Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try one of these new Lean Cuisine bowls. It's 20% more ounces uh, than uh, other Lean Cuisine chicken with almonds. Anyway, um, this one is the Sticky Ginger Chicken. White meat chicken with rice, vegetables, and almonds and a ginger soy sauce. It was only $2.99 at Kroger, so um, I don't think that's too bad. It is uh, 10 and a fourth ounces or 290 grams for the meal. It looks really good. Pictures do at least. Uh, 320 calories for the bowl. I don't think that's bad at all. There's your other stuff. So, directions on the bottom. Okay, so microwave oven only. So, good thing we don't do anything else anyway. But So, we're going to leave the film on the bowl. Really simple directions. Cook for three minutes, stir and recover, and then do another three minutes. Not bad. Let it sit for a minute to cool, to finish cooking and all that good stuff. Ah, frozen solid. There's the size of the bowl. There's what's in it. Looks like you get a decent amount of chicken. I see uh, quite a few pieces in there. There's one, two, three, four, five, five or six decent sized pieces and some smaller little pieces here and there. So I'm going to not vent it, get it in the microwave, and I'll be back uh, once it comes out. All right, so here it is out of the microwave, and I haven't touched it yet um, after taking the plastic off the top. It smells really good. You have to say that. You can smell the vegetables in there. You can smell the broccoli and the green beans, I think, more than anything. Uh, maybe a little bit of that, um, that sauce, like a gingery kind of smell. But mostly I smell the broccoli and the green beans. So, um, you can see you get a couple of big pieces of chicken. I'll probably cut those into smaller pieces. But anyway, I'm going to let this cool off for a few and uh, I'll be back. Okay, I gave it just a, a minute or two to cool off. So here's the bottom I'm going to take. It has broccoli, green bean, uh, I think there was an almond in there, some chicken, some rice. Um, Everything I could see in there. So here we go. The green beans are still a little crunchy, but I actually like them. I like the flavor that it adds to the meal. Um, it's got that good, uh, you know, that green vegetable flavor, which sometimes I hate. In this case, it's really good. Yeah, those are cooked really well. They're they're a little more cooked than a blanched green bean. They're a little softer than that. They're not quite as crunchy, but they still have a lot of that flavor. I'll try a piece of the broccoli. Same thing for the broccoli. Still has a lot of flavor, but it's a little tender, more tender than just the blanched um, broccoli. Let me see the chicken. I think it without vegetables. Yeah, that piece of chicken, I mean, the pieces of chicken in here, um, so far has all been really, really tender. I'm going to try this little sliver of almond. I can't see it, it's too small. The almond's a little soft. It's lost its, like, crunchiness, but, um, you know, being cooked. But I like the flavor of the sauce. I like it that it's not overly ginger. I wouldn't have liked it if it had been really strong, like, really powerful ginger, but it has that almost like a sweet and sour kind of sauce flavor. It has that little bit of uh, a soy sauce flavor. Yeah, I really do like the flavors of this. Um, 320 calories, only $3. Um, I think it's a really good meal. I'm gonna give this one, you know, there really is not much they could have done differently to it to where it would have been better. Um, Honestly, the sauce is good. The, the, the flavors of the um, vegetables are really good. The flavor of the chicken is good. The sauce is good. I mean, the rice is cooked really well. Um, there's really nothing I can complain about. So I'm going to give this one a 5 out of 5. Uh, definitely worth trying out. Um, the sticky ginger chicken. Uh, very, very, very good meal. Good flavors. Good mix of flavors. The combinations really go good together. Um, probably not a meal I would eat all the time, but I wouldn't mind eating this any time. You know, any, anytime I wanted to eat this kind of meal, I could. So if this flavor interests you, definitely worth trying out. I think it's really good. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.